Today I'm going to show you the second and final part of my two-part jack-o'-lantern series. First thing I like to do is sand my pumpkins to remove any ridges or burrs. Next I move on to paint. The paint I like to use is a chalk furniture paint with a primer added in. I start off with a base coat and I make sure I get my brush into all the little nooks and crannies. This is the messiest part. Once I get the main body of the pumpkin painted, it's time to start working on all the finishing details. I like to do is highlight all the details by giving it a good dry brush. For the first pass, I like to use a super sunny bright yellow. For my second pass, I like to use more pastel tones. Blending the two shades together as I go. Now it's time to paint the pumpkin's eyes, nose, and mouth. For this I like to use a white chalk paint. I draw my inspiration for my folk art designs from antique German Halloween decor. The use of chalk paint helps me to create that look. I just love vintage German jack-o'-lanterns. Each piece has its own distinct personality and I try to capture that same spirit in all of the pieces I create. Now it's time to paint the pumpkin's collar. For this, I like to use a black acrylic paint. This step usually takes the longest as I have to work the paint into the details under the main body of the pumpkin. This step is so worth it because it's details like this that make my pumpkin shine. Now it's time to move on to painting on his eyes.
This is one of my favorite steps in the whole process. Now it's time to paint on his nose. For this, I also use an acrylic paint. I use the same acrylic paint to paint on his mouth. Crimson Red is my go-to color for all of my vintage-inspired projects. It's the little details like this that brings my artwork to life. The last step in the process is to antique my pumpkin using a furniture wax. I gently brush on the wax and then I wipe away the excess with a paper towel. All finished. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to be notified when I post new videos.